Most political analysts here in Washington say there are probably three lanes to the Republican National Convention in Milwaukee, Wisconsin next summer. While the race for president expected to get even more crowded today with former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie entering the race, he'll make the announcement official this evening with a town hall in New Hampshire. Christie last ran for president in 2016. He served as governor of New Jersey from 2010 through 2018. He will be one of three candidates expected to join the race in the next 24 hours. Former Vice President Mike Pence has filed and he will make his announcement official Wednesday in Iowa and North Dakota Governor Doug Burgum is set to make a special announcement in North Dakota on Wednesday as well. Who benefits from a crowded field, a crowded race for the Republican nomination? Well, the last time over 10 candidates were in the Republican race for president was 2016. Former President Donald Trump secured that nomination. Most political analysts here in Washington say there are probably three lanes to the Republican National Convention in Milwaukee, Wisconsin next summer. Former President Donald Trump currently Currently occupying lane one. He has a 30 point lead when you look at real clear politics polling averages. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has been in second place consistently, but still well behind former President Donald Trump. And then you have the other candidate lane, and that's the lane that has gotten extremely crowded in recent weeks and will become even more crowded by the end of this week. As far as the next big moment in this race for president, it's likely the next presidential debate, the first presidential debate here in the 2024 presidential cycle. That is slated to take place in late August over the course of at least one night. It could be two nights if the field is deemed too crowded if the stage is too packed. August 23rd's event in Milwaukee, Wisconsin will be hosted uh, by the Republican National Committee, will air on Fox News. You will need at least 1% in the polls consistently in order to qualify, as well as at least 40,000 contributors. Fundraising and polling is how a candidate will qualify for the debate in late August. At the White House, Joe St. George, Scripps News, Washington.